All right, so today we're gonna to be checking out what I carry every day and the handguns that I keep in my rotation. So I basically carry one gun like 95% of the time and then I have a few other handguns that I keep in my rotation depending on the situation. We're also gonna be taking a look at everything else that I carry, which is not much. So let's go to the tabletop and let me show you guys what I carry every day. All right, so as I mentioned earlier, um, these are the four handguns that I keep in my rotation. Before we get to the handguns, let me just show you all the other stuff that I carry and then I'll get into the handguns, all right? So, all right, so I'm not trying to complicate um, my everyday carry, showing you guys all these handguns right here. But one thing that I've always been curious is when people show their everyday carry, I've always wondered, do they always carry that gun? I mean, what happens if they have to be tucked in? What happens if they're going on an interview? What happens if they're going jogging? So I've always wondered, and I'm gonna tell you guys um, why and why I carry each one of these firearms when I carry them. All right, so before we get to the firearms, let's talk about this stuff here first. All right, so this is a belt that I carry. It's just a nylon belt. It's one of those stiff ones that has an insert. Um, that's the brand right there. I've owned a couple of these, not the same brand, but a couple of nylon belts, and I think I'm up for a new one. Check that out. That's starting to uh, peel off when I'm carrying. Um, so the belt's still good, and I know I can fix this, but I'd rather go buy a new one, to be honest. So yeah, I do carry a sturdy belt, and this makes a big difference when carrying. So there you go, there's the belt that I carry. All right, so the flashlight that I carry is a Streamlight. It is a Streamlight ProTac 2LX. And if I remember correctly, this is either 500 or 600 lumens, but check it out. I've been carrying this already for a couple years. Look at all those dings and scratches. I've dropped this so many times and not on purpose or intentionally, but so far it's still running strong and I'm a big fan of this flashlight and they're very inexpensive, so yeah. I carry earphones, um, that's just, this is a luxurious item. This is not a required thing to carry, but um, nowadays it's very difficult going, leaving the house without earphones. So yeah, I carry earphones. I never use both earphones at a time, I just use one at a time. Um, so, but yeah, I do carry earphones every day. And a knife, to be honest, I rarely carry a knife now. Um, at work, there's knives everywhere, so I kind of stopped carrying this. So, yeah, I know I should still probably carry it, but a knife, I rarely carry it now. But I carried this every day for a very long time, or several years. But, yeah, I don't carry a knife anymore. Um, I rarely do, I should say. And just my wallet. Alright, so let's get to the handguns. All right, so my actual everyday carry is a Glock 19. This is the handgun that I was telling you guys about that I carry about 95% of the time. I'm always carrying a Glock 19 for the most part. In very few occasions do I carry these other firearms over here. Um, well, one at a time, I don't carry all of them at once. So yeah, Glock 19 is a gun that I choose to carry every day. Um, the reason why is because Glock 19 very used to it, very easy to use, and um, capacity. This has pretty good capacity, and I carry a backup Glock 17 mag. So, um, I carry this in an Alien Gear holster. This is a 3.5 inside the waistband, and I carry it at about three o'clock. And I also installed some Trigicon night sights. And I really like those sights because in the back, I mean, it's basically blacked out and then you just have the front sight in bright orange color. And these sights are really good, I like them. So yeah, this is my actual everyday carry um, that I carry, like I said, m the vast majority of the time throughout the year. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and put this to the side. Now let's talk about the handguns that I carry when I'm not carrying the Glock 19.
All right, so now we're gonna be talking about the Smith & Wesson Model 19. I choose to carry this revolver whenever I'm out in the woods. For the most part, when I'm out in the woods, I'm out hunting. So yeah, um, I carry the Model 19 whenever I'm, like I said, either hunting or hiking. So far, I like it. And so far, I've been carrying it in this um, 1791 leather holster. Um, I also carry it at about three o'clock. It's a very comfortable holster to carry. And whenever I am out hunting, um, obviously I have it loaded. And then I, for some reason, I always grab like two or three of these speed loaders and I throw them in my, ba in my backpack. I put one in my pocket and then I just carry a couple in my backpack. Um, so yeah, I carry a few of these speed loaders. All the firearms that I carry, I do carry at least one backup mag or backup speed loader. So yeah, the Smith & Wesson Model 19, I really like it. Um, I'm not the best with revolvers yet. I'm more comfortable with semi-autos. My goal is to get more comfortable with the revolver, shooting it, drawing it, um, and becoming more accurate with it. I've always wanted a revolver, and one great way to put it in my rotation, um, I filled it in with whenever I'm out in the woods. So basically this is my woods gun. Model 19, big fan of it, so far I like it, and it's gonna keep coming with me whenever I'm out hunting or hiking, basically any time that I'm out in the woods. So let's move on to the next one. All right, so the next firearm that I carry is the MMP Shield. I carry the MMP Shield basically whenever I'm out around the house, um, whether I'm mowing the grass or just doing chores around the house. Um, I also have the Trigicon Night Sights. These are the exact same ones that I have on the Glock 19, and I really like these sights. And I carry one backup mag for the MMP Shield, and I carry it in an Alien Gear holster, and I believe this is a 3.0. And just like the Glock 19, I carry it at about three o'clock. I'm very comfortable inside the waistband. So yeah, the MMP Shield, I carry it whenever, like I said, I'm doing chores around the house. For the most part, is whenever I'm doing yard work. And I also carry this once in a while when I don't want to print at all. This is basically a pretty deep concealment handgun because it's pretty thin. It's a pretty thin handgun. So I carry the MMP Shield basically around the house and that's what it comes down to. So yeah, the MMP Shield, I also really like it, but I rarely carry it unless I'm around the house doing chores and just wearing shorts and a t-shirt. And this, uh, it, it, it's perfect for that. So yeah, the MMP Shield, um, chambered in nine millimeter and one backup mag inside the waistband, alien gear holster at about three o'clock. All right, so the final handgun on the list or in my rotation. Um, this is the handgun that I least carry. I rarely carry the Smith & Wesson bodyguard chambered in 380. Um, so I carry this whenever I have to deep conceal. Um, I don't even know if that's a proper term, but I carry this firearm for the most part if I have to be tucked in. For example, I carried this at a friend's wedding had to be tucked in. We were wearing boots. That was part of the um, we well, was part of the dress code for the wedding. So all I did was put this inside my boot. Drawing it from inside the boot was probably not going to be fast. It was probably going to take some time, and I've never even practiced drawing the gun out of the boot. But I had to come up with somewhere to conceal it, and luckily we were we were wearing boots, and that's where I carried it for the day inside the boot so yeah um, I've even carried this inside my pocket in other situations where I've had where I have to be tucked in so yeah I carry this firearm it's six plus one and one backup mag I carry this firearm whenever I absolutely need deep concealment I rarely carry the bodyguard MMP 380 but it is an option that's the final gun in my rotation that I carry every day. Like I said, for the most part, I carry the Glock 19 all the time, 
but there is a reason why I keep all these other firearms in my rotation. Since I forgot to mention, just in case anyone comes across this video and they're not sure of what each firearm is chambered in, the Glock 19 chambered in 9mm, the Smith & Wesson Model 19 chambered in 357 Magnum, the Smith & Wesson M&P Shield chambered in 9mm, and the Smith & Wesson M&P Bodyguard chambered in 380 ACP. So yes, thank you for watching, and like I said, these are the handguns that I keep in my rotation for everyday carry. Thank you for watching, and stay tuned.